given below are the part A questions from the paper waves and optics. We may discuss them one by one. See the first question, what is a progressive wave? A wave that moves uniformly in a specific direction is known as a progressive wave. We equal to A sin omega into T minus x by V is an equation also to represent a progressive wave. See the second question. Define simple harmonic motion. A particle is said to proceed with the simple harmonic motion. If it moves in a straight line, with an acceleration that is always pointed in the direction of the fixed point on the line and is proportional to the particle's displacement from the fixed point. To and fro motion is called simple harmonic motion. In the case of simple harmonic motion, acceleration is directly proportional to displacement. Acceleration is directly proportional to displacement of the body from the equilibrium position. Therefore, A is equal to minus omega square into displacement. Where the negative sign represents the restoring force is acting in the opposite direction to that of the displacement. See the third question. What are beats? The phenomena of waxing and vanning of sound is called beats. See the fourth question. What are stationary waves? When two identical progressive waves travel through a medium along the same time in opposite directions with equal velocities, they superimpose each other and produce a new type of wave called a stationary wave. See the fifth question. What are Lissajous figures? When a particle undergoes two perpendicular simple harmonic motions, it follows a curved path called Lissajous figure. Because this phenomenon was introduced by a scientist Lissajous. What are the uses of Lissajous figures? With the help of these uh, Lissajous figures, we may compare two frequencies and we may determine the frequency of a tuning fork. State the laugh length. In the case of sonometer, when the wire is stretched under a constant force, the frequency of its transverse vibration, n, is inversely proportional to the length of the vibrating string. State the law of tension. For a string of given length and uh, given material, the frequency varies directly as a square root of the stretching force, that is tension T. State the law of mass. The frequency varies inversely as a square root of the mass per unit length when the tension and the length are kept constant. See the tenth question. What are the characteristics of a musical sound. Pitch, loudness and quality are the characteristics of a musical sound. See the 11th question, what's pitch? The pitch of a node is a sensation conveyed to our brain by the sound waves falling on our ears, which depends directly on the frequency of the incident sound waves. What is loudness? The loudness of the sound is defined as the degree of sensation realized in the air. 
define the quality of sound sound quality is that characteristic which enables us to distinguish between musical notes emitted by different musical instruments what's meant by the acoustics of buildings it's a branch of science that deals with the planning a building or a hall to provide best audible sound to the audience is called acoustics of the building define the term reverberation the persistence of audible sound after the source has stopped emitting sound is called reverberation it's a persistence what's reverberation time the reverberation time refers to the duration it takes for sound to decrease below the minimum level of audibility after the source has stopped emitting sound see the 17th question what's meant by the coefficient of absorption the coefficient of absorption of the material is defined as the ratio of sound energy absorbed by the surface to that of the total incident sound energy on the surface see the 18th question what are ultrasonics the human ear can hear sound waves between 20 hertz and 20000 hertz the sound waves having frequencies above the audible range are known as ultrasonics below the audible range are called infrasonics list of methods used to produce ultrasonic waves magnetostriction method and piezoelectric method are usually used to produce ultrasonic waves see the 20th question state piezoelectric effect when certain crystals like quartz tourmaline etc are stretched are compressed along a certain axis an electric potential difference is produced along a perpendicular axis this is called the piezoelectric effect give the properties of ultrasonics ultrasonics are highly energetic the their speed of propagation depends on their frequency they show negligible diffraction due to their smaller wavelength give the applications of ultrasonic waves ultrasonic waves are used to detect the flaws existing in metals you know the sonar sound navigation and uh, raging with the help of this we may detect the submarines iceberg as well as the depth of sea we may use ultrasonics for cleaning and clearing soldering and metal cutting formation of uh, alloys detection of uh, abnormal growth tumors can be detected with the help of ultrasonic waves final question is give the sabine's reverberation formula the reverberation time t equal to 0.161 v divided by s in t a here v equal to volume of the hull s yes, surface area a absorption coefficient 